of Jmook and uh, Cody, uh, right? Uh, no, well, Cody was in Rochester for a while. Like, him and uh, Jmook and Cody would play in Syracuse all the time. That's so funny. That, but, like that's, <laughs> but Cody hasn't been in Upstate in a while. It's just been uh, yeah, Mook, yeah. but he's leaving now, unfortunately, going to SoCal. Really? Oh, my God. So, I know that also Cody mm -hmm. left a few weeks ago. Uh, Co yeah, no, Cody, Cody was just there for college. He, was, he went to, I think, University of Rochester or RIT. No, like he's out in New York entirely. Oh, is he? I have no clue yeah, about no, that. Exactly. Yeah, because he had a going. He was actually mm -hmm. at nightclub for a going away. Um. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Okay, and yeah, this is. Let's actually talk about this match here. Uh, oh, yeah, e this is on the Marth. Oh yeah, no, e Poodle's his main is Marth. He is going oh. to be respecting. Yeah. Okay, is I was just. I didn't realize. I thought he was a fox main because he was just destroying me with fox. But yeah, no, he if he's that good, fox, he destroyed me with fox too. Although to be fair, I think he actually just does go fox. In the yeah, the may up. maybe like a. Se yeah, that makes sense. Did you play Peach or Sheik? Um, for when you were playing in Sea Poodle. When I was playing in Sea Poodle, I played Sheik. I played Sheik all day today, except for the uh, ICs. Yeah, just okay. because I did not want to play Peach ICs, or I did Sheik not want to play Sheik yeah. ICs. Yeah, and I didn't want to play uh, Puff Puff Peach. Yeah. Either those are both miserable matchups. Yeah, and okay, let's actually talk about the game here. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. This is one thing that I really like from E Poodle, <coughs> recognizing that right now how he loses this stock is through getting grabbed. And what is he going to do in order to not get grabbed? Never touch the ground. Yeah. And I think that That's this a great oh, strategy. No kill on Nana. Nana, get in the Oh, my God. Shield. She's so good at this game. Dude. I can't power shield the Marth. Yeah, no. I, that's that's crazy. <laughs> All right. But, uh, oh, my God. Okay. Toucan not able to get the punish on that up tilt there. And then he... Oh, the F smash? No. Oh, okay. He gets grabbed, gets up smashed, and he's gone. To, uh, both these players now three stocks, but uh, Toucan looking pretty damaged. E Poodle probably going to be able to close this out really quickly. All right, F smash on a Nana. She is gone. Oh, yeah, okay, she's going to live or die. Uh, Popo now kind of stranded on the left, all alone. E Poodle getting the down throw. Fair, that'll do it. Closing out the stock very nicely, and uh, three stocks to two now. Oh, barely, barely took a scratch. I will say, though, this is one of those matchups where e Poodle can just evaporate if he's not careful. But look at the what he's doing. He's oh, yeah. so careful. No, he's yeah, like e Poodle is playing, like, his, his spacing perfectly. Um, he, like, spacing perfectly, and he goes up to these platforms, tries to bait him to go yeah. up there. And as soon as he does, he gets punished. This mm -hmm. should be a dead Nana. Down yeah. there, into the abyss. Yeah, that propeller Nair is just so good at splitting up the ICs. It just it destroys them. Yeah. At the same time, it's not one that you want to necessarily go in neutral. Uh, a mm. lot. Instead, Marth's in this matchup. You combo of, into the... Yeah, it's tons of down tilt and forward air. Mm -hmm. And for the Icy's player, you kind of have to figure out. It's like a guessing game of when are they going to down tilt, when are they going to forward air. And the thing is that for both of them, it doesn't have a great option. Okay. It's a tricky matchup. I mean, I, I see some Icy's when they think a Marth's going to down tilt. They do like short hop fair. You're yeah. not oh my Nana's god, Nana gone. got teleported. Well, but it didn't work yeah, out. Either Nana gets teleported or uh, Toucan gets put in the Yeah, no, ground, but I just, yeah. that that felt like max range, I think. That was that was really far. Yeah, no, Nana has a lot of, especially vertically. I think that's like a big thing is that. Oh, thing. okay, that makes that makes sense. Because I know that one fun thing about Icy's, the sinking has to. Oh, oh rip Toucan. Damn, yeah. So the sinking has to do, it's, it's vertical. So that's why you see some ICs, they'll like have a Nana on the top platform mm -hmm. and the and the Sopo below And Popo that. below. And they're, and he's, they're doing like desync still control. Yeah, even though they're separated. throw out the, ice, uh, the icicles, uh, have Popo get on ledge, all that, all like that good alternating stuff. Alternating forward mm -hmm. smashes. So the reason why that works is because ICs. Um, that that uh, makes sense. The, the, the desync, or like the, the point where the Nana becomes her own CPU is it's, uh, it's X-axis based, not Y-axis based. Makes sense. Nana. Oh my god, Nana! Oh no, that up defensive it? play right there! Okay, and oh, good tech. At the same time, I think that, that was probably the predictable tech. Because uh, why would he tech roll? I feel like he was trying to tech roll to the oh, ledge. That's not going to kill? Yeah, but why would Martha ever tech roll to the ledge in this matchup? Oh, Ooh. the dare? F, F smash sending Nana to the f heavens. Yeah, and I think uh, this should be it. Yeah, charge forward smash. No, get not gonna get a charge. No, this could. He can make it back right now. Yeah, no, he's actually. Oh, dare, dare! Oh, that's 
not going to kill just yet. And he has his jump back, but that's going to do it. Yeah. All right, yeah. Toucan was clinging on to life there for so long. It, I feel like it was really just a matter of time before E Poodle was able to clean that up. Yeah, and like you could see that E Poodle, he was going for the finishers. He was just getting mm -hmm. for the reset, reset, oh. reset. Because at that, like, there's no chance to, you know, actually fuck it up. Yeah, and uh, here we see Toucan taking back that stock after E Poodle was at 100 after that last stock, so. But here we see Epoodle just racking up the damage on these two. Alright. Okay. Oh, that Ooh. drift back with the blizzard. Also, no, I love the full hopping from uh from Epoodle right now with no mm. platforms. It's actually pretty risky, but like it feels like he's not getting punished for it. Just That's very true. well timed. And okay, their double jump. He's gonna have to go right to ledge and ah the blizzard. But the fairs. Yeah. The fairs though. Pokes Nana th through Popo. Oh, oh and no! Time. And Popo's down! That is that is so sad if you're a Toucan fan. Yeah, but this is looking kind of grim for him. But okay, here's okay, the big grab. grab. Oh, it doesn't quite get it. He mm -hmm. went, for, I think, just like one two, pummel too many. All right. Just so you know, yeah. uh, so Wobbling is patched out of the version that we yes. played here. So that means that what Toucan's trying to do is get the maximum pummels before the game automatically breaks it. Which is three, right? Three pummels before it breaks, and that's trying to get as much damage as possible. Yeah. Before he uh, before he goes for the handoff, exactly. Toucan's got some really clean handoffs. I was playing friendlies with him before bracket. Plus, you know, I had to play him in bracket. It's, it's just disgusting how good his handoffs are. It is, but at the same time, like he hasn't necessarily been getting them so consistently on. A, well, let's see what happens right yeah, here. Yeah, Epoodle yeah. has been playing very sudden because uh, handoffs only work on the edges, right? And they can work also like you can see resets like that. Okay, that mix up. The thing is also I'm pretty sure SDI plays a part, and I think that oh. Epoodle is probably. I'm assuming SDIing in such a way that he's not getting hit by the worst of it. But there we mm. go. Nice job finally getting that stock with the grab. Right. This is one of the reasons why FD is actually really good for ICs is the fact that um, ooh, uh, it's so much easier to get a grab on Marth. Yeah. In those previous games, he would jump up to the platforms and just stay there when he was scared of being grabbed. There's no yeah. platforms to retreat to. Yeah, exactly. Result, he's getting chased down. Ice Climbers, you, you really got to play the floor as lava over here. Also, uh, oh, Nana just died, but I wanted to point out, Toucan taking his first lead in the set, uh, stock-wise at least, but True, looking yeah. like E-Poodle's about to even that up. Yeah, no, this would require, yeah, that would require a yeah, that mess smash up will do it. Yeah. Alright, and here we have it. One stock apiece, finally, we have Toucan making things yeah. close. Ooh. Oh, oh my god, those up tilts. up tilts. Yeah. Now, Icy's, the fact they're so slippery means it's so much harder to shield grab. Yeah, that tra the traction's so low. It's like second lowest after Luigi, right? I yes, think? I believe so. Yeah, it sounds, yeah. Okay, I'm liking this. Just going for these tilts. Quick damage, just poking him, getting what he can in. Yeah. He's actually so close right now. Bring this to a 1-1 one, one game count would be so pivotal. Oh, yeah. but here oh. comes the combos. Nano's getting Oh, but the down smash! Tunnel vision, just a little bit too much. Go goes for the Marth Killer and no Nana gets reversed on. <gasps> That's a dead Nana. He can't that get there in time Nana. to save her. Oh, oh and no one the dare, it. E Poodle. I I was really hoping to can would take a game. I'd really love to have a set on our hands. Right Honestly, I, I think I think Toucan can reverse sweep. He was play he's I, playing good. Uh, he's playing good, but he was playing good on FD specifically. Yeah. He's gonna have to play on those Marth counter That's picks true. with the platforms and everything. You saw the way he was camping and avoiding. If he if if Toucan isn't able to take a game here, what hope does he have with, like, you know, a, a yeah. best of three set? But we'll see right now. We'll see if there's adaptation that's going on. Mm -hmm. And right now, Toucan has not actually found an opening. Oh, nope. There he goes. Speak yeah. of the devil. One thing we also haven't seen, really, is an edge guard. That's uh, true. This has been very stage combat oriented. Yeah, which, granted, because you're on FD, uh, it's a wider platform. <gasps> <gasps> okay. No, and the counter. I love that. And Nana's dead as a result. What looked like? No, actually goes down there and saves her. Both of them are living to tell the tale. And that should do it. Yeah, as long as he does not mess this up. Oh, why are you going for so many Oh, crap? my God. He went for, oh, so many pummels. I don't, th that was just a little bit risky. And now he has to deal with this, like, even though he's only at 33%, one opening can yeah. have Nana die, which is still really scary. Yeah. You want to have as much of a lead as possible because you've seen the way that <coughs> E Poodle is playing. Ooh, okay. Getting the down throw into the up air dare. All right. Uh, and two can't take sock. And unfortunately, I'm so sorry. I have to leave my right is oh, here. Okay. Well, it was nice commentating with you, though. Commentating with you. All right, I'm about to be joined on the mic by my uh, 
my compatriot, my uh, brother in suffering, <laughs> Null. Yes, sir. That's the tag you're going with these days, right? No. Yeah, no, okay. With a lowercase n. Oh, I get it. It's right. a programming reference as somebody who's a musician. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Got him. Uh, got him. Anyway, yeah, this game. What are we game, looking at? What game is this? Counter-Strike? This is. <laughs> I, I, I don't wish I Dude, actually. CS2 looks so different. <laughs> they didn't change so much about it. I like that you can still teabag. The frame rate's much higher. <laughs> Wait, actually? What's the frame rate on CS2? Oh, I played it on a MacBook Air, dude. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, no, this is a uh, this is the, pretty much the final match of the tournament. Even though it's round robin, this was the number one and the number two seed. And oh my god, Nana, you just get fucked with you. <laughs> just just go home. And yeah, this is uh, this is pretty much what E Poodle's been doing the entire time. E Poodle, by the way, is, oh, just, just yeah. runs around his face and then forward smashes. He's just he has an absolute. That's, I feel that's such guy. a Marth thing. Oh, run yeah. around forward and then. <laughs> Run around Martin. and then press it's, A and it's win. It's two things that he loves doing the most. is yeah. running and just <laughs> hitting the A button. <laughs> oh, Nana, you're dead. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, oh what? Nana's not dead. Oh, shit. Nana's dead. Wait. Wait is Nana no. not dead? No, okay. We, okay, Nana's I dead. like that. He faked them out. Mm. And now you have one. What can? Who would win? One Sopo or three stocks of a top 100 mark? <laughs> Okay. Uh, all well, right. there's your answer. Okay. You have your answer. This is going to be the greatest comeback of all time. Never mind. Oh, you're a traitor. <laughs> and there it is. Three. Oh, that means that E Poodle is absolutely your champion of the night. Not dropping a single game. He had Damn. to play s six other players and just pop, 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 pop. 3 0, 3 0, 3 0, 3 0, 3 0.